need to pick three to five mangoes. After that, we will grab our one third amount of brown sugar. Hello guys! Welcome back to our YouTube channel! Hello guys! Welcome back to the Cebuano Siblings channel! So for today, we will be making pickled mangoes. I know the recipe and I'm going to show you it. So step one, we should go over to our sink and wash the mangoes. After washing the mangoes, we will let it dry for a little bit. Then, we will go over to our stove and we will add water on medium heat because we will be making the mixture for our pickled mango. We need to put it on medium heat and after that, you will pour water. Depending on how much mixture you want is how much water you will pour. So for me, I'll just pour one bottle. Yeah. Okay, let's put it on low heat. Guys, after the sugar melts, you will put salt, then vinegar. So after you're done, guys, mixing all the sugar, the salt, and the vinegar with the water, you will let it simmer for a minute on low heat. So don't immediately go with the next step. Just let it simmer for a minute. After letting the mixture simmer for a minute, you will then peel the mangoes. First, you will cut off the top. And after that, you will peel. So now that we are done peeling the mangoes, we will now cut off the cheeks or sides of the mangoes. These are the sides of the mangoes, or also known as cheeks. We we'll cut off the sides. So now that we are done cutting and slicing the mangoes, we will then sterilize the storage bottle. So once you see the water at this stage, guys, that there's a lot of bubbles and the bottle is shaking, you will turn off the stove. Now that we are done sterilizing the bottle, we will put all of the mango slices in the bottle. Now that we put all the mango slices in the bottle, the next step is to put the mixture we made earlier into the bottle. Then cover the bottle tightly and let it sit in a, a cold and dry place for 3-5 to five days. Or you can just simply put it in the fridge. This is the final product of our pickled mangoes. We will now put this in a fridge or in a dry and cold place for 3 to 5 days. 